Dear students, I welcome on behalf of Amity Institute of Organic Agriculture in the class of Introductory Entomology. We are coming towards the end of the session and the last order today we are going to discuss is Diptyoptera. What is Diptyo? Diptyo means network. The wings are network type. Tera means wing and Diptyo means network. There is large network. The four wings looks like a network type. So the order name was given Diptyo Tera. Before going back to the history, the history of life on earth is very old, 4 billion years ago. 99% of life forms have been extincted, only 1% are remaining at the present. So our history was very rich with very high diversity. It was very rich diversity in the past. Many have lost. Insect appeared about 400 million years ago. So insects are older historical and older insects because they appeared 400 million years ago. Dinosaur appeared 210 million years ago. And human beings just only 1 million years ago. <coughs> Great difference on the origin. Human beings come very new stage at very later stage. The oldest were the origin of life. Then insects 400 million years ago. Then dinosaur. 210 million years ago and human beings just arrived only 1 million years ago. What are the position of insects? If the animal kingdom is in two parts, invertebrates and vertebrates. Vertebrates means backbone. Insects have backbones like human beings. And insect without any backbone, there is no backbone. So the insects have no backbone, say so they fall in the invertebrates. So under invertebrates, there are many phylum like platyhelminthes, platworm, flatworm, nematyhelminthes, roundworm, their body is round in shape, mollusk. A snails and slugs, these are mollusks. Annelids, like earthworm, belong to the phylum Annelids, Annelida. And the biggest phylum is Arthropoda, which consists of insecta and other classes. Crabs, a spider, and different classes are there. And under insecta, we have study many insects including the present. Today we will study about cockroach and mantis. So the Diptyo Terra, the exact meaning of Diptyo is network. Network and being. They have network. The four wings which cover the hand wing look like a network. And the common two examples are cockroach and praying mantis. Why it is called praying? Because they catch their enemy on the four wings. On the four legs. With the help of four legs, they catch their enemies and they, then they eat their enemies. So they are called praying mantis. They are predators of a smaller insects. The head is hypognathus. Hypognathus means vertical direction. 
the jaw, mandible, brains, all are in vertical direction. Antenna is filiform, thread-like structure. Mouth parts are chewing type. They can chew the food materials. Tarsus is five segmented. Four wings are more or less thick. They look like leather type. And with they have marginal veins. Coastal veins are there. And they are called tegmina. Because of hard, hard wings. But hind wings are membranous. They are folded below the four wings. The classification of Dictyoptera is divided into two suborders. Dictyoptera have two orders. Number one is Blatteria, in which cockroaches are there. Number two is Mantodia, in which praying mantids are there. Praying mantis with example under Mantodia. So again we classify where is the position of Arthropoda. Arthropoda belong to animal kingdom. Invertebrates, phylum Arthropoda and the class Insecta. And Dictyotera, we will study the characteristics. They are medium sized. They have thread like filiform antenna. They have chewing and biting type mouth parts. Legs similar to each other. In mantis, four legs are rhapsorial. What is the meaning of rhapsorial? Rhapsorial means spraying type. Predators type. They can catch their enemy with the help of four legs. Their four wings is hard, strong and called tegmina. And the tarsi is five segmented. Tarsi is the part of leg touching the ground which are five segmented. Egg present in an uthika. Uthika is inside the body. Female with reduced ovipositor and male with asymmetrical genitalia. What is mean asymmetrical? Asymmetrical means the structure which cannot be divided into two equal halves. Any structure is divided equally are called symmetrical. But those structures which are not divided in equal parts, they are called asymmetrical. They have no auditory organs. Like grasshoppers have auditory organs, but cockroach and mantis have no auditory organs. These are the general character. Their body is medium size to large. The head is hypognathous. Antenna is filiform or cetaceous. Mouth part is chewing type and biting type. Thorax, prothorax, mesothorax and metathorax. Prothorax are larger and meso and meta are smaller. Wings, four wings are leathery, they are called tegmina. Hind wings are membranous, they are folded. Legs, four legs are rhapsorial in mantids. They pray, catch their enemies with the help of four legs. And cursorial in blatida. Male genitalia is asymmetric, means irregular in shape. The shapes are not regular. The ninth segment pair of pastile. The cerci many segmented. Cerci is the position of last organ, posterior end of the insect. So we have studied two suborders in the order. Dictyotera. Number one is Blatteria. In Blatteria, we have study cockroach. And they have four family, Polyphagida, Blaveridae, Blatidae, Epilamphridae. 
these are the four family of cockroaches and there are five families of mantis including mantidae this is the position of this is the difference between cockroach and mantid mantis cockroach head is not mobile in mantis head is mobile pronotum is shield like which cover the head pronotum is very long which do not cover the head body is flat dark color body is elongated sometimes cylindrical antenna is long and cetaceous antenna is long and filiform legs are cursorial legs are raptorial raptorial means praying type this is the position of blatidae the number of species are 4000 common name is cockroach the habitat is any area which is wet moisture is there then you will find the cockroach no ovipositor no saltatorial hind legs they have no jumping type of legs Uthika used in ovary position. They lay their egg with the help of Uthika. Blatidae. This is the family of cockroach. American cockroach is the scientific name Periplanta americana. German cockroach have scientific name Blatella germanica. So, antenna is long. Four wings are. a stronger leather type called tegmina legs similar to one another tarsi is five segmented they are mostly household pests they are the pests of houses house materials like kitchen materials and others this is the uthika of cockroach they lay their eggs with the help of uthika you can see the different morphology of cockroach periplanta americana this they should be written in italics and americanas a should be a smaller and the size is 34 cm 34 mm to 53 mm long means they are 3 to 5 cm in size they are divided into head thorax and abdomen the entire body is chitinous made up of chitin the head is six segmented like grasshoppers you can see these are the mouth parts labrum labium lower lip hypopharynx tongue labrum upper lip mandibles maxilla what is the difference between male and female cockroach male cockroach have longer abdomen female cockroach have short abdomen male have longer antenna female have short antenna in male anal styles are present in female anal styles are absent now What is the scientific name of cockroach? It is Periplanta americana. What is the position of ovary in insect? In the cockroach, the position of ovary is on the fourth, fifth, and sixth segment. There are ten abdominal segments, and the ovary is located on the fourth, fifth, and sixth segment of the abdomen. how many segments are present in the cockroach abdomen total 10 segments are there what is the function of malpighian tubule they are excretory system they make the toxic material the nitrogenous material out of the body 
Name the locomotory appendages of cockroaches. These are legs, three pair of legs and two pair of wings. Now mantodia. This this is mantis. You can see the praying mantis. The four wing is a special. Four legs are a special. They can catch their enemy with the help of four legs. 2300 species have been identified they are predators they catch other smaller insects how they are useful what is the classification classification eukaryotes means they have nucleus so they are called eukaryotes animalia means belong to the animals arthropoda jointed appendages Insecta body is insected. Mantodia. This is the order. Family is Mantidae. Genus Astragomantis. And species can be different like Carolia. Astragomantis Carolia. This is the family Mantidae. Their body is cylindrical and long. Elongated. They are raptorial, means praying type. They can catch their enemies. Their antenna is short and filiform. Their pronotum is longer. The nymphs are cannibalistic. What is the meaning of cannibalistic? Cannibalistic is the property of female. Female copulate with the male. And after copulation, male is killed, and the female eat the head of the male. This is very surprising. That property is called cannibalistic. Uthika, egg laying person is called uthika. They lay their egg. Many eggs are there. They have incomplete metamorphosis. No pupa. You can see egg, egg then, egg, nymph, and adult. Pupa is absent, so they have incomplete cycle. One story I already said that female eat the head of the male after copulation. This is very surprising. Some studies say that only 15% of the praying mantis. Females consume the male, not the all. What are the agricultural importance of the praying mantis? They are controlling the mosquitoes. They are controlling the population of other vectors, other disease-causing insects. Are they are predators? So they are controlling the disease. They are used as biological control. They produce organic food. You can see reduce insecticides because they are predators. They control the other enemies, so they are controlling the insects. So we are not using insecticide. So we are saving the plants with insecticides. Improved yield. Yield is higher due to less attack of insecticides so these are the beneficial use of these insects in agriculture so summary is all insects are important all most of the insects are beneficial for ecological balance they control the population of many pests which are dangerous for agriculture so they are also called ecosystem services they are serving the ecosystem they have role definite role in the food chain they are also important for agriculture and natural system they are decomposers they are breaking down of plant and other organic matter they are helping in mineralization and recycling of plant nutrients so they are useful to agriculture now we can discuss